Hey, what's up, guys? Um, well, I am bored today, so I figure I would use my mom's iPad to record a video because I've got nothing better to do today. Um, anyway, um, what's going on with me? Um, I've completed my hours of uh, community service over at Minutes for Animals. However, um, yeah, I'm still working out there. Um, you know, I like it. It's pretty cool. Um, probation officer is like, well, you need to find a job. I'm like, okay, cool. Well, you know, I'll find a job after I get my car in August, get my license back, you know, because my license has been suspended since February. Anyway. She's like, well, um, you know, Eastland County is already pissed off at you because they try to send you to Wilmer, and then they try to send you to, say, P, and, you know, you got out of going to both, so they're looking for any reason to hem you up and make you fuck up, you know, so. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Um. Uh, so yeah, um, I'm kind of stressing about that, um, you know, it, it's, it's just kind of hard, you know, considering the fact that, you know, the last job I had was in August of 07, the last paying job, and so it's like, I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do, because, you know, nobody wants to hire two kind of convicted felon who has not been employed, or who has not been employed since, for the past five years, you know. Um, you know, Linens for Animals, the organization I work with, or, you know, new marketing for and shit like that, <coughs> you know, they're willing to give me a raving reference. However, I've only been working with them for the past year. So I really don't have any way to account for, um, the lapse of employment in essence from 2007 to 2000 or to 2010. Um, not really sure what I'm going to do about it. Um. All I can do is, I mean, the thing of it is, is people say, well, you know, you can go get a physical labor job. Well, you know what? I don't have, I don't, I, I'm not built like that. I am I don't have the upper body strength. I don't have the stamina. I've got a bad back. I've got a fractured collarbone. Um, oh, shit. Okay, yeah, you can see it. Um, basically, I have metal plate, rods, and screws in my shoulder, right? Okay. So, anywho, um, <laughs> um, I mean, I really can't do a whole lot of heavy lifting, you know, I don't, I just, I just can't do it, you know, um, can't really work in a fast-paced environment, you know, they say, well, go, go to McDonald's, go to Wendy's, well, I can't work in fast-paced environments, because, um, I get all clustered, or, uh, flustered, and then when I get flustered, I can't think straight, and all this other fucking shit, you know. So, um, you know, I mean, I've, I've got a lot of experience with customer service, customer relations, marketing, advertising. I do not want that door-to-door -door shit. I don't want a job where it's commission only because I can't handle that. I can't handle sales you know, I've tried telemarketing all that other crap. You know, I just can't handle it. I'm I'm not cut out for it. You know, I know what I'm capable of, and that's something that I'm not cap I'm not cut out for. Um, and then people say, "Well, beggars can't be choosers." Well, I understand that. However, I know what I'm capable of doing, and I just see no point whatsoever in trying to do something that I already know that I'm not capable of doing. You know, um. So, you know, if anybody's got any suggestions out there, I'd really appreciate it. I don't know who's, what is it, fuck him. Okay, I'm at four minutes and 23 seconds. I really don't know who's actually going to take the time to, like, actually view this video, but I figure I'd just do it because I've got nothing better to do. I have no idea how gay I sound in this video. I'm yeah, I know I ain't going to do it. I'm tired. Um... I'm just pissed off and frustrated all the fucking time, you know, I mean, it's just like, you know, I'm 32 years old, I live at home with my parents, I'm fully financially dependent on my parents, people say, well, 
you know, if you don't like your situation, then get up off your ass and do something about it. I understand that. However, I'm not the type of person who um, makes shit happen, you know. I need doors to be, I mean, in essence, I need somebody to open, give me an open door. Give me an, uh, give me an opportunity, give me a chance. And once I'm given that chance, then I'll put in 110% effort. But I'm not good at finding opportunities. People say, well, that's just an excuse. Well, you know what? It is what it is, okay? You know, I mean, fucking, I, I know what I'm capable of doing. And that is something I'm not capable of doing. I don't know. I'm just running out of shit to talk about. So anyways, I guess I'll go ahead and just cut this off. Um, if anybody's got any thoughts, please reply. Thanks.